Hello guys, today we're gonna do something a little bit different. This is a game I enjoyed a great deal once upon a time and I thought I would share a bit of this with you. So, let's get into it. We're gonna play the original campaign and we're gonna play it on Nightmare, which is essentially the hard difficulty. So, yeah, I'm gonna let you watch the intro now. They're walking weird. <laughs> Hopefully the traffic will be bad. Dinner reservations are late. Oh, I can't believe how hard it's raining. We sure picked a great day to celebrate my birthday. Oh, it's just a little rain, a little dry. Anyway, we'll be there in no time. Nothing bad could happen in rain. What? Yeah, you should really watch the road there. Or not. What do I care, daughter? You like buddy? <laughs> and now we're dead. Okay, so this was a fun game. And wait, what? No, it's not over. But we died. Huh? Here. Most interesting. Wait, what? They're extremely powerful and well guarded by their minion hordes. Wait, hordes? Why has it taken this long? Lucifer? Ask him what I did. Ask him why he thinks I deserve this. He didn't say. I was sent to offer you this chance, and that is all. He has his reasons, and he doesn't have to explain them to anyone. Do this, and you will be pure. I was pure? So you say. I'm not here to debate. Do this, and you're free to be with your Catherine again. You were chosen because of your abilities. You've managed to survive this long, and that is impressive. This is what has set you apart from the others, and he thinks that you're the only one capable of pulling it off. Okay. Why he just take care of this? Why can't you do it? If he gets involved, the assault we're hoping to prevent might be launched prematurely. And of course, we want to avoid that at all costs. We think they're going to attack soon. He wants you to stop them before they are poised to strike. He wants to force okay. them So you're going to have to move quickly. Kill the generals, and Lucifer's armies will retreat. Either you take this or you don't. If you don't, I can't tell you when we'll speak again. I know you've been here for a while, and I assume you want to leave. Your time has come. Take it or leave it. Okay. Good. Do you need weapons? I've survived this long, haven't I? I know where to get weapons. Good. This will help. Drink it. It will help you survive. Now keep that squad. Use it as you guide and destroy everything that moves. We must move quickly. We must kill the generals before they organize for an attack. Destroy everything that moves. Most interesting. So, why do I get this sinking feeling that we're being used here? 
Anyway, yeah. We died. We're in purgatory. We have to kill Lucifer's generals. Business as usual. Let's go kill some demons. As you might have noticed, this is a shooter. And we start with the blender. Actually, that is really loud. I'm going to turn it down just a bit, say, to 65. Yeah, that's a lot better. I do hope the audio levels are alright. If something's wrong, don't hesitate to tell me. I can't fix it in the comments if you don't tell me what's wrong. I mean, I can't fix the settings for the next video. Boom! Yeah, these guys, they're not very dangerous as long as you keep moving and don't back yourself into a corner. The, that stuff, that guy who happens to be an angel who wants us to kill demons, that stuff, well, he gave us a magical map so that we could track these guys we are supposed to kill. Ouch! And an elixir that allows us to eat the green stuff, which is demon souls. We gather enough of those, we enter into Hulk mode, and we can smash everything. Ten points if you can guess how many of those we need to eat before that happens. Those of you who guessed 66... Yeah, 10 points. Anyway, let's have some fun. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this, even though I tried to record this a couple times before, but the frame rate sucked and the settings are all wrong. But now, it I managed to straighten it out, so that's that. Anyway, yeah, these guys. They're your basic zombie horde. They're not dangerous unless they back you into a corner. Stay aware, don't let anyone sneak up and... assault your ass. And this is really stupid, but... armor is a good thing. Okay, you time your shots, shoot them in the face. This is a shotgun, so the shots spread out a bit, so you kind of need to aim them so as to get as much of the shot into their chest as possible. Aim for the center of mass, right here-ish. See this triangle here? That's where you aim. Boom. Goodbye. Yeah, they're not really dangerous, these melee slobs, unless they actually back you into a corner and then, well, prepare for gang rape. That is not <laughs> fun. Anyway, this is a really awesome game and let's use the blender for a bit just to demonstrate just how awesome this can be. Blend, lady, blend! Whee! <laughs> oh god, that's fun. Yeah, playing this on hard, so... Yeah, I think I mentioned that. So, checkpoints don't regenerate your health to a hundred, and... Well, yeah. Munition is more scarce, monsters are more powerful... Ouch! Okay, now... You don't want to complete them to let them complete swing, so hit and run, hit and run. Or you can toss this whole thing. <laughs> oh god, this is so bloody. Very graphic violence.
Okay. Yeah, we have plenty of munition. The first level... We don't want it exploding on us at an inopportune time. See, this area is kind of a bit more dangerous because we have limited maneuverability, but there were very few monsters in here, so th that wasn't really a problem. But the next level, it will be... Well, there will be a lot of fighting in tight quarters. This is more of a warm-up act than anything else. Oh, one of these. Yeah, if they do that whole banshee screech thing, which they do do. <laughs> Whoa, hey guys. Your whole screen starts going black and if there's a group of them and they start screaming at you, it gets really annoying. And if there's a group of other fuckers, frackers, whatever you want to call them, around... Oh yeah, you're gonna have... Damn it, those are fast! Holy crap! <laughs> they chopped that guy's head off! <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot they do that. <laughs> Hello! Boom! Yeah, see, it's center of mass. Don't aim for the head, center of mass. You want to sink all of your shot into a single guy from close range. And always stay mobile. Even if you can't see the monster, stay mobile. Try to avoid getting hit and try to stay aware of what's going on around you. Okay, arrow at the top, pointing towards the next objective. There you are! Boom! Yeah, watch, I'm gonna let them scream at me. Ooh, ammo pack. Come on, scream. Yeah, screen goes dark. Very, very bad. If there's a lot of them, you can get overwhelmed like that. I have some experience with traditional shooters and... Uh, I've played this game a lot before, so I know how to deal with the monsters, but yeah. Oh, hello. And let's head here. Boom. Come on, don't run from me, darling. There's nowhere to run. Oh, damn it. As you can see at our ammo down there, we have four bullets for our alternative fire mode, which is a freezing beam, which we will use a bit later. Ooh, yeah. Golden armor, golden armor. Excellent. And there was an ammo pack in there, and those souls have faded out, and we have less than a hundred life now. And that is not destructible. Yeah, I did this level once already, but... DX Story decided that it needed to record it with the wrong codec, and as such I ended up with one frame per second, and it was completely and utterly unwatchable. So that was fun. Boom! Boom, bitch! <laughs> oh yeah, there's gonna be a lot of them now. Oh, damn it! Okay, careful. This is the big, nasty battle, so let's... Did I get anyone? Yeah, you hold down the primary fire and then press the alternate fire and it does this alternate fire laser beam and it fires the head of the blender as a projectile this just blends will it blend? it will blend <laughs> blend buddy blend <laughs> come here <laughs> oh god, that is so fun. 
Oh, damn it. Yeah. They get stabby and it starts really hurting. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> yeah, there is. You can unlock cards as you finish levels and you can then buy those with money and they give you special abilities the first card is essentially for free all you have to do is finish the level but hello yeah we're good we're good okay and we're gonna morph into a demon when we hit 66 so I'm gonna save that for the final stage yeah <laughs> bye bye wait there's more <laughs> and another one yes seriously okay that's the last one for this let's break those and get the coins we gonna need them you can't actually use the cards which you unlock unless you have the money to place them in your active set okay save well auto save there okay okay we're gonna kill a couple of these guys power up and go postal on these fuckers okay one more <laughs> Suck it! Yeah, we are done. That's the exit portal. Yeah, those red souls are from the more powerful monsters. They give you more health. So, yeah. Heaven's using us to do its dirty work. Fun times. I wonder if I can beat some treasure out of that. Nope. Yeah, you can sometimes beat crap out of the bodies, but nope. Okay. So. Well, actually, 12 minutes. It's not much. So... Okay, so you can see we have this card here and we can place it here, only we can't because we don't have a hundred coins. So, I'm gonna do one more mission. Because I don't want this to be too short. Hope you're liking this so far. Yeah, this level, there's gonna be a lot more close quarters fighting, so I need to be more careful. We're gonna get weird monk guys in a second. Right about now. They sometimes throw those eggs, so you have to be careful. Boom, bitch! Pick up the souls, every bit of health matters. Yeah, we have to destroy all objects. I'm gonna try and do that, but I'm not gonna obsess over it too much. Okay. So that was relatively easy, but there's more to come. Whoa! Yeah. Not done with this yet. Oh, let me buy, let me buy. Eh. Oh crap, cornered. That was stupid, I lost a bit of health there. And we need to go up there because there's a secret with a destructible... Ooh! 
and that does not destroy, yeah. You can tell by the sound that it's a non destructible one. This seems suspicious. Here we go. Yeah, they spawn in four different places, which makes it harder to stay aware of them, and they toss those axes of theirs, so always need to stay moving. Move, move, move. Here we go. The trouble is that they can so easily surround you, so you want to stay away from the edges. I mean, the center of the room. Stay at the edges. It makes it harder for them to sneak up behind you and <laughs> you know, you know. Think we might get the third weapon here, or m I'm not sure. We might. I don't remember. Oh, damn it! See? Axe drawing. Not cool. Keep strafing, keep moving. Yeah, see, we're getting wooden stakes, which means the stake gun is somewhere nearby. Strangely enough, there is no vampires as such, just demons in general here, which kind of sucks. A stake gun is, in my mind, kind of an anti-vampire weapon, but okay, I suppose. Still, it's a very awesome game. Really like that sort of dark, bloody, hellish feel to it. And we need to destroy all the crap here quickly. And it will give us coins which we will then use to buy upgrades. Boom boom boom. Okay, here we go. Yeah, there's gonna be more stuff upstairs, but I won't be able to get that unless I come up at the... come back at the end of the level, I think, so... I'm not gonna worry about this too much. Did I miss the stake gun? I might have. I think you're supposed to have it at this point, but... Damn it! What the... In what way I wa was I too close to an explosion? Boom! Okay! That was... Totally not surprising. Okay, I can go back there. Let's quickly check if I left the stake gun somewhere. Oh, hello. Okay, let's pick up those coins. Okay. Moving on. Lots of explosions here, so... No, 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 no! Damn you! Freaking demons! Oh! Those guys! Damn it! They are fast and dangerous! Okay, keep shooting! Pick up the souls. Whew. Oh, damn it, see? Dangerous as fuck. The monks, they're generally your basic zombie horde yet again, but those jinn, or whatever they call, are meant to be there dangerous oh hello
Okay, we're clear for now. Oh, damn it! Fucker! Boom! Yeah, sometimes if you apply enough damage in some way to a dead body, they bleed explosives. Normal weapons won't do it, you have to either slice them or blow them up with a barrel or something. Yeah. Blend him. Oh, damn it. Okay, from that side then. I'd like to have that armor, it could be useful. I think it's a silver one too, which means 150 points. It should be nice to have. Oh, I know you the Can't fool me twice. Frackers. Nope, just bronze. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I missed the stake gun there. At some point. Well, that. Oh, and those guys. Yeah, that smoke. Not a good thing. Okay, moving on, moving on, keep moving, kill the barrels, have... Yeah, they're throwing their axes, at least they die after they throw their axes. Yeah, can't really push forward with these guys because of the smoke. It slows you down and damages you and then the other enemies catch up to you and uh, you are in deep trouble. Anyway, let's slaughter a lot of these frackers while we have Hulk mode on. Okay. We killed a bunch of them just there. Oh, I wanted to blow him up with the barrel. Damn it. <laughs> oh damn it. There you go. Goodbye. Yeah, and I'm just gonna kill the rest since the souls don't matter that much. We're close enough to the end that... Gonna be fine. And really, there's no way I could have gotten down there to pick those up. Later on there's a level where it matters a bit more, but not right now. So, objects destroyed, 90 out of 114. Yeah, I'll have to go back. I'm pretty sure I'll have to go back. Oh, and that's a health. It gives you 25 health up to a maximum of 100. So if we had less than 100 health, we could use that. But, since we have more than a hundred, it's useless to us. Isn't that wonderful? Boom! Boom, bitch! Said boom! Yeah, and the final level. Those weird priest guys with the smoking skites and the afrits, I'm gonna call them afrits. In tight quarters, no less. Okay deep breath. 20 enemies. Not that many in the grand scheme of things I suppose but we don't have our next weapons so stay gun it's very powerful but it's a single slow moving shot so you damn it see 
Ah, oh, frack! Frack me with a spawn! Damn it! You bastards! Die, you fracker! I find that it's very effective to freeze and shoot those gin. Sorry, Afrid guys. You just have to wait long enough for them to actually freeze so that you can shatter them. And we are at one more enemy. Will it blend? It will blend. Oh no, it doesn't damage you. That was a different variation of the same fracker. So... Okay, yeah, we need to go back real quick. Oh, feel free to skip ahead a minute or two if you don't want to watch this. So, I hope you're enjoying this so far. And really want you to... Let me know what you think about this. Because me... I'm kind of enjoying this, and especially when I get the proper version of DX Story, which will be in a couple of days, and that annoying watermark is removed. You know that whole blue DX Story point dot com uh, thing is well, you know, once that can. Well, I'm really thinking about making more videos of this game cause yeah it's fun it's not too well yeah I kind of feel like playing some of this and I might as well make videos about it for your pleasure and enjoy and I need to find six more objects Okay. Yeah, I remember using the steak guns grenades to try and get a grenade up there in order to remove that. So where is it? Where is my fracking weapon? Back here somewhere? Seriously, how did I miss it? It's supposed to be here somewhere. Nope. No way, it's all the way back here. So, yeah, I would really like to see your comments on this. And I can't remember which card I got for this level either so there's an interesting question and it's just f three more objects in any case I'm not gonna bother you too much about this I think I'm going to end the video here and show you the card next time so Goodbye for now and make sure to leave your comments. Bye bye.